Hey everyone, so today I'm going to be swatching the new Killer Queen Cosmetics Pastel Eyeliners. These are cake eyeliners, technically. They're also known as paint pods, so they are activated with water. Um, this is an indie brand that I do have an affiliate code with. You can save 16% off using the code TASHA16. I will also put the link in the description. I do make a small commission, so if you don't want to use the discount, you don't have to. But I was really excited because I love pastels, and I think that these are going to be beautiful for the spring and summer. So, of course, I wanted to swatch these. The artwork is beautiful, so I'm very, very excited, and I'm very happy to be showing off indie brand products. I definitely like to do that as much as I can. So if you guys want to see swatches and, you know, me talking about them, then just keep watching. So this is going to be a little different than my usual swatch videos. I'm just going to be doing a full-on, like, talking through video for the most part. So I got this set. I did pay for this myself, but I am affiliated, so I do have a discount code now. But these retail for 35 US dollars and you get eight shades of eyeliners. And like I said, you just use water. You just add a little bit of water onto a brush and then you apply it. These are really beautiful and neon colors. This is with no flash. And this is with flash. Now, some of these shades are UV activated. I sadly don't have a UV light, but some of them are UV activated. And you can check out on the website which shades those are. But since I don't have a UV light, that's not really why I have bought them. I just bought them because I love pastels. And I definitely think pastels are super popular right now. So this is what the eyeliners look like. Swatched just one layer without flash on they're really pretty uh the honestly the yellow and green look really similar right now but um the top one is the green and then these two are the yellow and then those two are the peach and then you have the pink the purple and the two blues honestly the purple and the two blues have the best formula the other ones are a bit dry but these ones are really pretty and then there's all seven of them with flash. I didn't swatch the white one because I'm going to be giving that one away. But these are really, really pretty. Um, I think that for the price point, they're pretty good. I'll also include eye swatches of every shade on my eye. They came packaged in this cute little box, which was a nice touch, I'd say. Now let's get in to the eye swatches. Basically, I did an eye look. This is what the purple eyeliner looks like. It is my favorite for sure. It's really stunning. I have done every swatch with flash and without flash. I just ended up using every shade in this look other than the the like the darkest blue which I will include a swatch of at the end. This was literally my third time doing graphic liner, so no, it's not perfect. Y'all can make fun of me if you want. I did my best. I have very shaky hands, so some of it I did okay. Formula-wise, these lasted all day. They did really, really well, actually. Um, I definitely could have done a better job at application. I definitely think that I need more practice, but I'd say for a third try, this look turned out pretty okay. I'm not a makeup artist. I just do makeup for fun. I'm definitely really happy with these pastel liners. I don't have anything like them, and I haven't seen any mainline brands doing this sort of product. Um, but there are a ton of indie brands that have made the exact same product. Um, this is the cheapest that I've found, and the quality is pretty good. And again, if you use my discount code, you do save 16% off. You don't have to, but if you want to save some money, go for it. Um, but yeah, no, I really like these. I definitely love the purple the most. Obviously, purple's my favorite color, so I'm very excited about that. There are a lot of indie brands that have come out with this exact same product recently, especially, but I think that's just because pastel is, like, in season right now, especially with, like, all the pastel palettes coming out and stuff. I do want to do, like, <laughs> 
Butte Bean did a Battle of the Pastel Palettes. I definitely want to do something like that. I am going to do a video comparing all of my pastel eyeliners since I have gotten another brand's pastel liners because I wanted to compare them to this brand to see if the formula was the exact same or whatnot. But honestly, I'm really impressed with how these lasted. I have decently watery eyes and they actually stayed pretty good. So I'm super impressed. They remove so easily, you guys. Like, it literally comes off. You just use water. They wipe off right away. There's no staining or anything. I'm really, really, really impressed with these. I definitely think for the summer, like, they're such an easy product to use. Personally, I would recommend getting the Suva Beauty um, eyeliner brush for these. I think that that one is the best. They have different sizes. I think I have the medium one. That is my favorite brush for this product. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please subscribe if you aren't already. I'll be doing a big giveaway when I hit 2,000 subscribers, which is coming very soon. So make sure you're subscribed. Go follow my Instagram, Makeup by Tasha XO, and I'll see you in the next video. Oh, stay tuned if you want to see videos of all my cats, since I know some of y'all love that I add videos of my cats at the end of the videos. So as always, we got some cat videos for you. You know you're not supposed to be up there, baby. Baby boy, you know you're not supposed to be up there. Oh, that belly. Oh, you gotta go on a diet. Me too. We can go on a diet together. Um, boy, hey, 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 hey. Yes, it's good day. Yes, it's Maria. You don't do that. I'm watching you. I am. Don't get scared. Are you guys watching him? Are you guys keeping an eye on him? You're like, what the hell is going on? Huh? Like someone else we know. Oh, bless you. Then for now? And Chloe's still under the bed? Yeah. <laughs> Look at that tail. Yes, fight, fight, fight. Have you did crazy? Did you hear that thump? Oh, Chloe. You're, you're not in the right position, Chloe. Come around the side and get him. You notice how he just throws himself right down in the ground. Oh, That's a good ass. one. Yes. Be nice. She just came inside. Fight him. What kind of a jump was that? He's not like boy. No. laser pointer to see if you go in circles. Because he does a little bit with this thing.
Aww. <laughs> he wanted to jump across, but he was too scared, so he used to close as a bridge. He knows you have it. Quit being mean. No, he's looking for it. Quit, he doesn't know. Quit being mean. He has it. Meow.